everyone, my name is Jessica and I am a personal trainer and owner of Fitnessing by Jessica, which is an online personal training company and I specialize in obstacle course training and weight loss. Uh, so what I wanted to talk to you guys about today is something that is very near and dear to my heart, uh, something that really has shaped the way that I train myself and my goals in this lifetime that I have and I kind of wanted to share that story with you guys just so you could understand it just a little bit and that thing that I am going to talk to you about today is American Ninja Warrior so it's not just for the kids everybody thinks that it's for the kids and it's the kids that they're uh, you know inspiring and encouraging and things like that so but it's also us adults here as well. We uh, like to inspire to become a ninja ourselves. Yeah. Uh, so I kind of wanted to give you guys a little bit of a background as to why Ninja Warrior is so important to me. So as mentioned before, I do a lot of obstacle course racing. So they kind of go hand in hand really when you think about it. Obstacle course racing, you get a run and then climb over and swing on a whole bunch of stuff. In a Ninja Warrior, um, you basically just climb and swing on a bunch of stuff. Take away that running. Um, but it definitely is a little bit more mainstream than obstacle course racing. Uh, generally speaking, you probably, if you were asking people on the street, probably more of them would know what American Ninja Warrior is versus obstacle course racing. I'm sure they hear obstacle course racing and they kind of go, oh yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Anyway, completely tangent right there. Anyway, so American Ninja Warrior. How did American Ninja Warrior enter my life? Well, it probably it entered my life probably around the same time that it entered a lot of women's lives, and that is in 2014 when Casey Catanzaro uh, did her mega huge run um, where she was the first woman off the warped wall and then she was the first woman and only woman um, to complete a finals course and that's when I first started watching it. I believe my mom told me about it. She says, you know, you should really watch this show. It kind of, I, I think you would enjoy it. It really kind of meshes with what you believe in and what you strive for and everything. So then I started watching it and I got to see Casey go up the wall and then I got to see Michelle Warnke go off the wall and then lastly I got to see Megan Martin go up the wall which was huge and I got to see Casey finish the finals course and all that stuff and so I really enjoyed it and I was like you know what this is something that I'd want to do this is pretty BA so you know my husband and I kind of kicked up our training and everything and it was something that we really 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 wanted to do um, but then that following October was when I found out I was pregnant. So I went through my whole pregnancy not getting to watch any American Ninja Warrior. But if you've watched my other videos you do know that I suffered from postpartum depression and uh, when you have depression lots of times you kind of end up just grasping at anything that's available to you for you to believe in for you to look up up to for you to kind of pull you out of this deep dark hole that you're in and for me that definitely was american ninja warrior um on those really hard days it seemed like it was definitely there for me on those days where I look at my child and think oh my goodness you know I put on all this weight I can't take care of my child I have panic attacks every single time you know I'm by myself with him uh, he's never gonna grow up he's always gonna be this little he's always gonna be this dependent on me this always 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 and all of these negative things were always coursing through my brain and when I needed to grasp onto something positive to distract my line of thinking it seemed like American Ninja Warrior was there. I spent a lot of time on YouTube looking up uh, past runs and old episodes and I don't know how many times I watched Casey finish that finals course and it was 
it was there for me to kind of help bring me out of that horrible place that I was in. And I just remember when I would be down solo and not thinking I could last another day or another minute or another second, all I would have to tell myself was just make it till Monday. You make it till Monday and American Ninja Warrior will be on. You get to watch it. And it just seemed to just always be there. And it was what gave me something to look forward to. Now, it seems like American Ninja Warrior always kind of comes into my life when I need it. And so it was there when I was so depressed after giving birth and it was there in my darkest of times afterwards. Cause that's the funny thing about depression is that you never seem to be able to escape it. It's always going to be there. You can be better. You can feel better. You can act better. You can believe you're better, but it's always there. And when those deep, dark holes seem to come back, American Ninja Warrior seemed to always come back into my life, which is funny when you think about it, but it just is. And when I went through another horrible time where I was highly depressed and I was suicidal, that is when I found my ninja family. And it was one of the most amazing times for me, even though I was so depressed and even though I hated where I was at and I was not in a good place, I was able to go and train and do this thing that I love and participate and be a part of a ninja family and I got to train. I got to train with people who are on the show. I got to go watch uh, people compete and it was one of the most amazing experiences of my life and it still is and I would not be here now sitting in front of you filming a YouTube video if it wasn't for American Ninja Warrior because I don't what would I be talking about? It was American Ninja Warrior that strived me to get my personal training certification and to open my own business and help other women achieve their goals. And whether their goals are just to lose weight or to uh, run obstacle course races or to compete on American Ninja Warrior, if it wasn't for that show, I wouldn't be where I am now. So I just wanted to share that story with you guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that you come back to my page and you watch my other videos. I do have some up right now that you can watch and I'm hoping to get some more up for you all. Um, if you have any questions, whether it's about American Ninja Warrior, about personal training, um, about postpartum depression, about being a mom, any of those questions, be sure to comment them down below. And if you liked this video, I would love it so very, very much if you would give it a big thumbs up as well. Uh, click that little subscribe button and come back and enjoy more videos as I put them up. I'm hoping to get you guys some videos for workouts, some help with exercises, what exercises you can do and how to do them properly and to build up your muscles so that you can, you know, swing around like a monkey or get up that warped wall or do whatever you want. Um, so I'm get, hoping to get some of those videos up for you guys, as well as more story time videos. I'm going to hopefully get some other moms who I have met through the ninja community to share their stories and uh, share them with you guys so you guys could see them. So I hope that you come back, click that subscribe button, like my video, and 
be sure to follow me on my other social medias. I'll be sure to link them down below as well. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope to see you soon. Thanks. Bye.